Yes. Well, the last set just finished and just real was on. As you can see, David in the back is absolutely <laughs> giddy with excitement like a schoolgirl because we got pulled on stage. Oh, we did. We got pulled on stage with Industrial. We got taken off by security. We sung a bit. And look at David's face. Look at that happy little face. Look at him. Oh, he's so cute. So we're probably going to come back later a bit more happy and a bit more not out of breath. But um, yeah, we're going to be finishing off the con vlog and A surprise at how epically awesome this con has been for both me and for David for my vlog. So um, yeah, we're gonna be getting back when it's a bit quieter. <laughs> David's still being giddy now. He's David, still with industrial. If I can do the ship at zero training, so can anyone. I ship this so much now, this is being shipped. <laughs> this is being shipped. I don't even know it's gonna be a piece. Everybody must ship it. So anyways, call the question, you're industrial music. Let's do the ship. Yes. Ah! This is going to go up on the internet. <laughs> this is going to be going up on the YouTube. We're going to be doing this, and brilliant. Hopefully, Industrial will be working with us. We hope we can, because that'd be it absolutely be fun. epic. I can't promise anything because I'm a lazy bastard. Yeah. We all are. We all are. Because it goes through like three other people. <laughs> but yeah, we we're currently going through David's fantasy at the moment. So yeah, we're going to wake up soon, and it's all going to turn out. As long as everybody's happy. It's going to turn out that we're going to wake up and it's all just going to actually be Friday still and we've got the entire con to go. And now... We've got David and we've got MC Arch together in the same room. What's up my people, MC Arch is in the building, my love to you all man. I'm proud and honored to have been on the stage here for you man. It was a great honor, thank you very much. Remember, I gave this guy the shout out when he finished his set but now he's actually here in person on his own. Check out the dude stuff, MC Arch. His music is off the chain. Thank you. And he's, and he's one of the most huggable guys ever. He's so soft to hug. Yeah. yeah. Can I pose you for a picture? <laughs> of course. Do you want me to take I'm, a picture? I'm, yes, I'm, I'm going to take, gonna take a picture for David. Okay. 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 <laughs> oh, there we go. No. And now we're saying our goodbyes, and we've run into the lovely Ali Monty, Hi. who actually hasn't it's appeared on the vlog so far. I have, haven't I? I waved to it. Yeah, you yesterday. popped up, but this is the first time you've actually spoken. I've actually spoken. I know. You subscribe to this channel. It's so weird. It's like I've been Wherever avoiding this it. This is on YouTube. Subscribe to it. This guy is cool. I've been avoiding Ali Monty. The whole, that's a liar. Yeah. <laughs> oh, don't cry. <laughs> but now we are saying our goodbye. So, yeah. Monty, thanks for being here for the con. Thanks for being on the vlog. As I've enjoyed video, it. Thank you for such a wonderful panel. Yeah, thank you for everything. That it's really been absolutely good. fantastic. These guys did a great job with their panel. Oh, thank she's you. so modest. She's yeah. just. She's lying. I was She's listening. Lying. It was a train <laughs> No, it wasn't. But yeah, we are going to head out where it's quiet. I'm going to get my... Bye. I'm going to get my hearing back. And we're going to say goodbye to the awesome dudes. I'm always going to... What is your name again? Which one? Real online? Whatever you want to give. Real name, Brian. Online. Brian. The best name ever. But I will always remember him. Online. Funny pony. I will always remember you as Mr. Marvelous, though. That was an amazing, Mr. Mav, that was that was an amazing a fantastic cosplay. Admittedly, if you did cut off the mane and change the outfit, you could be Donald Trump, which also works. Yeah, but then Brody's aren't supposed to hate, and I wouldn't want to do it. True, that. true. You turned up in a four piece white suit, he won the floor. I know, I know. He deserved to win. He was awesome. So during the discussions, the uh -huh. uh, debate session, somebody asked if Rarity would have a problem with Donald Trump with his wig. <laughs> I pointed out that she, designed, she made one for Cranky Doodle. Remember, you've got his details. And, and Check this white, guy out. And she's working. <laughs> Check this guy out. He is absolutely awesome. Brian, we love you. I do. We love your beard. Uh, and we're saying goodbye for tonight. Bye. Say bye. YouTube, say bye to Brian. Thank you, Brian. It has been immense. I'm going to sum it up at the end of it more than anything else. So there's probably going to be a wrap up and all that. Right now we're going to be going back to the hostel. We're going to be getting everything sorted, all the merch, packing, and I'm going to get over all of this epicness. I mean, industrial. We, got, I got pulled up on stage with industrial. Found out he's a massive fan of Pab's work, so that makes me feel good. And so much other good stuff. We got backstage and met all of the guys. So. I'm going to be saying my final goodbyes. David's going to be saying his final goodbyes. He still can't believe it all happened. He's as good as a schoolboy. Uh, I, I know, remember, English how to... Yes. English is I failing won. him. 
But yeah, we are going to be finishing this up. I'm going to be saying goodbye, sir, and then we'll be back when everything's a bit quieter. So uh, we'll catch you guys then. <laughs> Just waiting for our flight back. This will literally be the end of the vlog before the whole wrap-up stuff. But I just noticed the, the departures board and the arrivals board is having a little bit of a rave. And I've never seen them do that before. They keep flashing different colours. Never seen that, but it looks kind of cool. Rather calming as well. Someone just loop all this footage and just put some techno music over it and make it seem like it's having a full-on rave. <laughs> so we're here at the end of the con vlog and what can I say? It's been an absolute roller coaster of a con. I've enjoyed it so much. You can tell it's a couple days afterwards. I've finished packing everything away, but I wanted to take this time at the end of the vlog just to say a massive thanks to everyone who made the con so special for me and a massive thanks to you guys watching it because knowing that you, wherever you are in the world, are enjoying this it gives me the drive to do other videos and it just makes me happy to smile because the one reason why I do these con vlogs is one, to document it so I can look back at past events and smile but also so other people that couldn't be there can see a glimpse of what it was like and hopefully share in the in the wonderment of it But. Brony Scott 2016 for me has been such a turning point. It's been such a wonderful con and massive, not in size, but personal, personal reasons for me. Because so much has happened. I mean, I've got to do my first panel. That was immense. Technically, it was mine and David's first panel, but I don't know how he feels. For me, being asked to be on a panel was beyond overwhelming and actually doing it, seeing how much fun you could have, I absolutely loved it and I adored it. Afterwards, I actually got to do a bit of vending, selling stuff and all that and I've got massive respect now for what the vendors do because having to take all of the questions, manage everyone coming and looking, you just got to keep happy and it takes a lot of effort, trust me. Also I got to do my usual con vlogging stuff, which was awesome, but I think the biggest reason why Brony Scott for me was so good was because I got to help people. And I'm not saying that in any big headed way. There were a few friends of mine that had things they needed done and it made me feel good to help them and see them be happy. And to be able to do that made the con extra special. Plus I got to talk to a lot of amazing people and I'm talking people both from the vending side, from the guest community side, musicians, everyone and it was brilliant obviously got to chat with Eileen Monty and most of that actually happened off camera so I'm sorry but I really don't like having chats with people and keeping a camera on if I was gonna have a personal conversation it'd be that and then if I was gonna catch him off guard then it obviously went on camera also got to see MC Arch chat with Industrial Wooden Toaster got to go backstage with them which for me and David was absolutely awesome I mean that really made Rock Nessie for us but then I also got to sit down with some good YouTubers who I can hopefully consider friends, such as Mad Munchkin, who, make sure you check out her stuff, the link's gonna be down below. She sat down, had a chat with me about how I can probably do better on the whole YouTube thing, which was immensely helpful. I have no idea how I'm gonna implement it, but still. Also, got to talk to Stormblaze again, wonderful person, once again, links are all gonna be down. And, I've got to say, one thing about the panel that made us laugh was the run-up to it because of Captain Horse. And it'll be shown a bit later, but Scribble Sketch, David, you know him here on the vlog, he did a wonderful bit of artwork. Check out his stuff, once again, the links are gonna be down below, about what it was like for us at the panel. And honestly, it was hectic. If enough interest is there, I'll tell the story about what happened. But uh, yeah, getting back on track. It held such personal value to me, this Brony Scott, that I can say it's one of the best cons I've been to yet and hopefully I'll get to go to many more, who knows. I may do panels on those other ones and that's a scary thought. But also I want to say a big, big thank you to you guys watching. Whether you're new to the channel or whether you're a returning subscriber, thank you for watching this. If you've found some essence of joy through this, that makes me happy. 
Hopefully, if you're new, you will subscribe and you'll share it around. And if you're already subscribing, then share it around. Obligatory pl plug, but, um, sorry. But, uh, yeah, massive thanks. I do these vlogs so that people that couldn't get to them can have a small little window of what goes on. And hopefully they can join in on the fun, on something they might have missed. And to know that someone might have got some happiness, that makes me happy. So... To all of the guests that were there, to all of the new friends I've made, to all of the old friends I got to see, to all of the vendors, to all of the con staff, to everyone that made the con so fantastic. I just want to give a massive, massive thanks. I hope you enjoyed the vlog. That's it for now. Then until we see you again, much love to you guys. Stay safe, peace out, all that good stuff, and I'll catch you in the next video.